Just when you've been with us while we watched the draw there, Walsh all away, what do you make of it? Yeah, I think any, any chance for us to play a team in any divisions above, um, in their case League 2, is, is a great draw and I think you know, we're away from home, obviously would have loved the home game, but nevertheless we've got to go there and, and, and get a win and move on to the second round. So. Yeah, you said that's another away tie, but hey, we've already won three away from home, haven't we? Yeah, I, I think I think we back ourselves away at this point. I think early on in the season we wouldn't have thought we'd been doing as well um, away, but right now we're, we're in some form away from home, which is good. So. I think we're going in with a lot of confidence, obviously a couple of weeks from now, but we, we'll be ready for this tie. It was a great away performance on Saturday at Tamworth, wasn't it? 3-0 uh, scoreline and fully deserved it. Yeah, I think it was an all-round good team performance. Everyone chipped in. Um, we had, you know, Omar scored a very good goal to open us up and Tyrone scored two very good goals again. Um, he's, he's on a roll, but... I think we've been showing the last month, month and a half that you know we can play football and play good football at that. So we, I think you know we're looking forward to the next couple of months um, and try to get our season back on track. Well, I mean, you know, you look at some of the draws that clubs have got. All right, we didn't get the bye, we missed Sunderland, but to get a pro club at a big stadium and the National League go a lot of their meetings there, so I know the stadium well. Uh, it's fairly easy to get to from a fan's point of view. There's a station right on the on the ground, so could have been a lot worse. Could have been a bit better, but league club away from home, got to be positive. How did you feel about watching the draw there with the rest of the Darlow fans? And I'm sure you were like us when Sunderland came out there. Everybody was praying it could be our ball. Yeah, I, <laughs> it's funny because people have told me that you know leading up to now, um, but it is kind of nerve wracking. I mean, I've never been a part of something like this. Um, but I still felt the energy and felt the like suspense. Um, and there was a couple times where the ball, the teams, uh, the right before us so or right after us got called, and we were just like, "Whoa!" Like it's getting close, getting close. But you know, we, we drew also, and and that's that. So. Yeah, what about the tension there eh, when the balls were coming out, and you know the anticipation when the Sunderland ball came up? Uh, yeah, well, they, they, they were drawn at home, and everybody just stopped for that second while they pulled the next one out, and then when. I think Hartlepool as well was we were quite close, and then they pulled 55 against somebody we didn't want. Yeah. So at 56, you know, I think one or two thought, well, you know, we, it could have been better. But when you look at some of the distances that, we, that some clubs are going to travel, mm -hmm. you know, I think Walsall's not a bad area compared to from the fans' point of view. We're getting there definitely. It's your first taste of FA Cup favour, though, isn't it? And you seem to be thoroughly enjoying it. Yeah, I mean, from going to. From going from watching this on TV to you know playing in it is also is exciting to say the least. So I'm I'm really excited for this opportunity for me and for the lads and for the whole club.